What up, everybody? This is your boy Theo Pence here. Make sure you subscribe on YouTube so you don't miss any Run Your Race content. But we got some questions for you, brother. Let's do it. We got some, we got some, um, who we got hung? We got, we got some comparisons. First, we're going to ask you first. Shea or Luca? Who has the deeper bag? <laughs> Ooh. I was just talking about Shea the other day, too. Bro, it's tough, bro, because they both had that herky-jerky, slow, like, type of, like, game to them. Yeah. Deeper bag. I'm probably going to give it to, to Luca, bro. Cause just and I'm only saying that because of like his shot, the way he gets his shots off. Mm -hmm. We're talking about just straight handles, yeah, bro. Shea probably got him there. But as far as bag work, getting his shots off, bro, I might give it to Luke on that one, bro. The, the, the shots I've seen this man make, bro, just in pickup, not mm -hmm. even in the NBA games, yeah. just in pickup, bro, is unreal. And I've, I personally only played against Shea maybe twice uh -huh. in my oh, okay. entire career. Okay. okay, I've seen highlights. You know, you I've see obviously you gotta, seen you gotta scout, play against him a little bit more. But man. I play against Luca yeah. a lot. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, now we see where you're coming from. <laughs> nah, you gotta play, no, you gotta play against him a little bit more. What's Shea, bro? Luka, I think he's solid. Shea is more. super nice. <laughs> he's solid, bro. I super really, nice. I, like bro. the dude is the issue. <laughs> he gave us like 35 last year. Shit. <laughs> Luca about to get the keys to the league, bro. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, you're right. He on the cusp, bro. He on the, he on the cusp, cusp, bro. He on the cusp. Bro, there was this other question, I, bro. I got to find it. If you got any more comparisons to ask. Bro. I just seen this on Please. Twitter. Do you think, would you put Jamal Crawford and Lou William in the Hall of Fame? Bro, the Hall of Fame is dicey, bro. It's such a, you can answer it's so this tough, thing. bro. Oh, yeah, both of them. For what they've done, <sighs> culturally, yes, bro. But in the business of this league, for what they've done, they never got the recognition they deserved. I agree. And they, that's going to hurt them in their Hall of Fame, like, you know, inductee or like any type of like yeah. honor. Like, I think culturally, we all kind of know in the hoop culture, them niggas are valid, bro. Facts. Both of them. Super. <laughs> Super. Facts. Coming off the bench, doing the crazy thing. You've seen them hoop in the summertime. But for the casual fan and for the people who are actually on that committee, I don't think they'll give them the flowers they deserve. No, I agree. So yeah, I agree. I agree. Mm -hmm. My biggest thing is, my biggest thing is, if one gets in, the other has to get in. Oh, hands down, most definitely. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, because they definitely. both have pretty much the same accolades. They was. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So if one gets in, the other needs to get in. I don't think they're getting in. I think the question is how many six men a year do Jamal have? Three, four? Yeah, he's got like a three or four. A few, bro. That's a lot. Yeah. yeah. That is a lot. And it ain't like just like six, six men is a starter. Averaging 10 points. Reliable, too. A six, like <laughs> and. and <laughs> Let's go ahead and put this out there too. No, f that. Jamal Crawford is a Hall of Famer. I I agree. I <laughs> he, agree. Jamal Crawford is a Hall of Famer simply because he chose not to be a starter. Mm -hmm. If he uh, is yeah. a starter, yeah. he's a Hall of Famer. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. That's yeah. a good point. He like everyone's like when you bring Jamal Crawford to a team, they're like, okay, that's our sixth man. Yeah. He could easily be the starter on any team he go on. Easily. So that's why I believe he's a Hall of Famer. Lou Will, I mean, he got. Two? Two or yeah, three. One of those, yeah. Jamal has a better case, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was about to say, he, he <laughs> so played like, more. He played longer than I mean, he's still Luke. averaging 50 in Pro-Am, so. He had 51 yesterday. <laughs> he had 51 the other day. I'm like, <laughs> what the hell is your problem? Yo. <laughs> What up, everybody? It's your boy Theo Pinson here, and we have a huge announcement. We have officially partnered with Prize Picks, the daily fantasy sports game, the best one out there. Head over and go download the Prize Picks app. You pick between two to six players, and this is a skill based fantasy game. You only play against the Prize Picks projections. It's simple you pick for more or less. Prize Picks is matching up to $100 of your first deposit using our promo code RACE. Go to prospects.com slash race and use code race for a first deposit match up to $100.